good morning guys it is wednesday i thought i'd do a weekly vlog why is it so bright i'm like literally right in front of the window just around 8 30 i'm just gonna have a quick breakfast before work anyways i thought i'd do a weekly vlog again even if it's at home and i will try to make it longer some of you weren't happy that my last vlog was only like seven minutes but it's so hard to get like vlog footage but i'm gonna do my best and be on it okay when i watch vlogs i don't care like if they're at home like i just don't care if they do the same thing i just like watching them but because it's me i just feel like oh my god like why would you want to watch me like in my messy house like it's so boring <laughs> there's so much clutter i mean it looks clean actually it's been cleaning anyways i've just put my spf it's been like 30 degrees plus in the uk which is considered a heat wave for us i'm wearing a cute little dress this is actually from h&m i got it from i got it last year i can't wear anything else like i need to be like free and flowy because it's actually really hot i'm not complaining but it's it's definitely really hot this is what i'm using as my camera stand i've just got my work laptop here i'm just gonna sign in quickly so i can get a bit of an early start i was supposed to go in to the office um yesterday but i had to go to the dentist the day before and i had the worst migraine i don't know if it was because of a mixture of that and because i get so like anxious and built up like i just had the worst headache and plus i had injections i'll probably make a teeth video like a teeth update video soon why am i hunching over sit up straight <gasps> have you have any of you guys watched black widow yet oh my god i love it so much i've watched it twice i watched it in the cinema and i watched it at home on disney it's so good so good i definitely recommend it i don't know if it's just me this hey, spf is so glowy like i haven't even put a highlight but it's just the spf i need to put it on my shoulders too so i've been obsessed with this sourdough bread is this sourdough bread yeah it is um it looks like this it's so good i just prefer it to regular toast at the moment put the hot water on get me a cup of tea my massive humongous one my mum does this thing where she puts these things in the sugar. I literally have to dig, dig through the sugar. With this bread, I do like it kind of like toasted. I'm sat really low right now so that I can be in the shop. You know what do you want? What do you want? She always comes when I'm eating. I've been watching Love Island and honestly, it's such a joke this year. Look, please tell me what I'm watching. I feel like I'm only watching for Cats and Liberty. I just love their bond that they already have. It's probably going to spoil it if, you're not, if you haven't watched it already. But I just pop a thing, Lucinda. Lucinda's just playing the game and she doesn't care if people can see it. And Toby is just so annoying and definitely has anger issues. Like, you can't be that dumb. Like, you just cannot. I really am growing on Chloe because I just feel like she's just this carefree person. Mm. I actually am rooting for Aaron because he seems like you not know, a genuine person. Oh, and I, I do. I am starting to like Millie and Liam. Best thing ever. Well, I'm at my desk again. There's nothing new to see here. I thought I'd show you some PR that I got today. I actually got a few boxes, which is so weird. But um, I've got an event later on, a virtual event, which I'm really excited for because I'm going to be making some cocktails. The event is actually with Barry M and they sent me all this cute stuff to do like a full face with, some straws for the cocktail. And they sent me so many nail polishes. I actually used this one this is called pineapple punch i'm so shocked at how quickly it dried and it does definitely has like a gel effect how nice does this green look i want to do that one next to be honest when it comes to summer times i get so worried about the animals because they get really really hot and it also gave me this really cute ice cube uh thing which i'm gonna go do quickly for our drinks later i guess this is the drink that we will be making it's a daiquiri it's got rum in there i'm really considering to shave him because he's so hot. Look at them big boys. Don't lie. I just feel like the excitement just never gets old. But this, like, you know, some bits, like, just really shock you. Guys, I'm going to be um, going to, like, a virtual masterclass of uh, makeup by Mario. Like, that's the closest I'll ever get to Kim Kardashian, okay? I've got his whole collection. Like, they've literally sent me everything. Oh, my God. It's with Cult Beauty and Makeup by Mario. I'm so excited. Master himself, the master of makeup. I got sent 
Ariki Skinny Mirror. I've heard really good things about them. Oh, this is so heavy. Wait, oh my god, thank you so much to Cult Beauty for sending this over and I literally cannot wait. Oh, excuse me, that's my office chair. Okay, we filled it in, we're gonna put it in a freezer now. It's slouched. <laughs> I know, I was vlogging earlier on and I was proper slouching. Derek it's... saw my hair and he's like, what the hell did you do to it? I was like, what do you mean? He's like, you spent like 50 pounds to do what? Because I've got layers. Which just, I the same. Men just don't get it. Okay. okay excuse me, can you not see the thick of the layers coming out? <laughs> yeah, but you can only see it when you style yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. My sister got like the layered look too. It's a bit shorter though, no? Yeah. It's up to here. Guys, when I used to do my sister's hair before, I used to like literally pull her head in all directions because she would like slowly just like bring her head down or like turn it to I the side. It too tight. You don't want it tight? No. It will feel tight when I'm pulling, but once I let go, it'll be fine. Yeah, I want to get um, Charlotte Tilbury makeup. Yeah, I like her makeup. I have her bronzer. Her liquid highlight is so nice. So there's this um, thing that I saw. It was like a... It's like this powder. I think it's new. And a girl did it put on this girl's paws. And they disappeared. What is it? The primer? No, it was like a powder. It's hard to see braids on black hair, especially if you're filming it. Oh, isn't it the airbrush powder that I have? I think it's ow. Sorry, I'm just- Ow! Ah. Biggest drama queen of life. Oh, my sister's hair is so thick. Like, it's literally like mine times three. Don't say that. The whole reason I've got loads is to thin it out. And she wants to thin it out. We always want what we don't have. I would literally die for your hair. Like you don't even need to do like volume or anything. Hey, that looks good from the back. Look how thick her braids are. Wow. I did that good. I did it rough, just not perfect, but it looks good. Make sure to stay hydrated, people. You can see a bit better there. Oh, my sister's got feet masks on, which I really need, but for my hands. And. That just made me want to put uh, my own mask. I'm going to be wearing this today. I got this from Superdrug. And I love the Moisture Bomb range by Garnier. So, I'm going to put this on. I actually put it in a freezer for like five minutes. Just quickly to cool it down. Because I'm literally boiling. Oh, that's on really nicely actually. And it's so cold. Oh my god. Oh, the lighting is not too bad. I'm actually getting ready for the uh, Masterclass with Barry M. I'll I've got all my bits here, and I've got the ring light, my cocktail glasses, some brushes for the makeup. Just talking about this. Like well. So next we have the heat wave bronzers. Message inside. Um, they're like a message inside. Oh, we're just creating some palm trees. Mine aren't that great. Yeah, it's a bit. Yeah, that. I'm just trying to get my hand in that. Fifteen seconds shake. Holding it with both hands. Let's go. And then for garnish, we have the little rosemary that we saved earlier. Cheers. Ooh. Cheers, all. Really nice. <laughs> Cheers, guys. <laughs> yeah, try not to spill anything. Yeah, this is so nice. So nice. I love it's it. It's so good. I feel like yeah, I'm on holiday. Really nice. Gabby, mm. yeah, we'll have to top up your trunch. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It's my second holiday. <laughs> Okay, so I finished the masterclass. It was so fun. Thank you so much to Barry M for having me. It was, like Everyone was so lovely. And I learned a few things about drinks too. So, so, so fun. I mean, I have tried better cheesecakes. Hi guys, it's now the next day. I'm actually going to show you guys how I make my burrata bread, if that's what you call it. I'm so gutted. The ricotta cheese is like the main ingredient and I opened this one the other day and it's just off. Like you can tell it's off. So I'm just gonna, I just ordered McDonald's. I'm gonna try the new McSpicy because apparently it's good. Lately I've been obsessed with uh, baklava. I demolished it like, but I don't like this one. It just tastes a bit weird. 
Okay, so I've got all these packages to go through that I've just been building up, building up. Guys, it's giving me anxiety. I'm so grateful to have all of this, but I do get more than I need. But sometimes I get sent all the shades. So I'm going to do a giveaway kind of bundle and then a to film. I don't know why that's here. A to film to try bundle. To be honest, I could keep Hula Toasted. So actually, I'm going to do Hula Glow as a giveaway and who would have toasted for me i got these glasses but they really don't suit me so next i got this new mac mascara i'm gonna try that actually um i actually looked at this already it's basically lenses for your phone camera it gives this like really cool effect that i really want to have fun with so definitely we'll try it this out put it in my to try box i've got a dark and a light shade of the nymph glaze so i'm going to keep that for giveaway next i got this from l'oreal i'm gonna keep this for giveaway it's too light for me what's this this is a it's a cream with spf 50 i'm gonna keep that and try that actually this is a top up of my dermatica uh treatment they actually up the strength of the treatment as you go along and it's been doing wonders i've also been using it on my back and it's been really helping with my back acne i have worked with them but they're so good definitely recommend them guys it's like um personalized skincare for you done by a dermatology team um, and it's really good then I got this humongous package from elf cosmetics They're, they were so kind to give me all of this I think I'm gonna keep it all just to try in a video then I got some new bits from Murad I actually really like this SPF 50 then we got some of the environmental shield dark spot serum definitely gonna keep these Take a little break ah, that was really done I think we're supposed to keep the water this is the burger and I present you breakfast or what I this is breakfast. Hmm. Oh, really good. Not only does it taste good, but I like the texture. And like the fact that when you bite into it, it's like really like crispy. So I would give it a pizza. Which is quite spicy. <clears throat> Reminds me of the KFC yeah. burgers. So it's gonna be the pork for dinner. I hope I have enough food. So yeah. <laughs> I have, you have to eat my fries it's with like my burger. And then Guys, it definitely gets like a this? thumbs up from me. You know what's really sad? You want to know the honest truth? I went We're just watching one of uh, Click for Taz's vlogs. Apparently, the heat wave in the UK is nothing for you. Some of you in the US, like it's been 30 degrees Celsius here, which is like 80 Fahrenheit roughly. And I've been seeing everyone on TikTok that apparently that's nothing. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna get some food. I think I'm gonna have some pasta. But anyways, I've been in watching Love Island and honestly, I can't I can't stand some people in the villa, like for example Toby. Never being in a relationship doesn't give you the reason to treat people like crap, right? And I'm so glad Danny left because we didn't need him. And I'm kind of growing on uh on Liberty and I think it's Jake. I just ordered some food and I'm waiting for it. I managed to get through all the PR products. I've got like a to film, to try box, a giveaway box. I washed my hair and it's so hot that it literally dried in just by itself. <laughs> this is so hot. I've been so obsessed with this is local restaurant that we have. And they do amazing just like pasta and prawns. I love, I love it so much. I wanted to treat myself. That's what the food looks like. Mm. Mm. I love, I'm gonna go enjoy this. I braided my hair last night whilst it was wet and it's just become, what has it become? I don't know, it's just become this wavy thing. Okay, so that's all folded up. I don't know what to have for breakfast today because I don't, I'm not really feeling anything. I'm, what I really want is a Starbucks right now. I might order one. Just having a quick brekkie. I've got a vanilla iced latte and I'm not feeling it, but you know, I have to drink it. I did have plans for tomorrow, but I canceled them because like, I just feel like I'm doing something every day. This one. Ew. I hate bugs so much. Okay, I managed to film a quick Instagram video during my break. Now I'm gonna um my shopping came through. I got I did a quick um Audi shop because literally I have no time to do anything. 
Okay guys, I'm just gonna quickly show you how I make my bruschetta bread. It was, there was too much noise around me. I toasted a piece of sourdough bread and put a bit of olive oil and also scratched a clove of garlic. And I put a good generous amount of ricotta cheese, my chopped cherry tomatoes on top and uh, some chopped basil. And I just sprinkled that on the top. And yeah, literally that's all you have to do. And it's the best thing ever. You can thank me later. Hey guys it's now saturday i've done a bit of filming i make some pasta because i'm starving it's 1 20 and i still haven't eaten anything i already cut a bit of onion some garlic and now i'm just gonna chop up some mushroom i literally had to um uber in some parmesan because mine went off i don't know about you guys but when i used to cook before i would always just start with the onion but now i start with the things that take the longest to cook so i'm gonna start with the chicken and the mushroom first I've got both of these on a high heat and I'm going to put the mushroom in there. The chicken's going to go in here. Put our pasta in. Just put the onions in. Love the smell of like cooked onion. It's so nice. Oh my god, this red lip is so nice. Then I'm going to put around half a cup of white wine. And let that reduce. Then I'm going to put double cream. Like around 450 ml and also like half a cup of chicken stock and we're just gonna let that cook for a bit so in goes the mushroom I forgot to cook the garlic so i'm just gonna cook it here quickly okay we've now got the pasta ready and i've also put the chicken in here and the last step i need to do is just put a bit of parmesan i'm gonna put 50 grams of parmesan i've just mixed everything together and i'm gonna put an egg yolk in there mmm and it, it will just cook inside with the heat. I just want to mix this. Just listen to this. Mmm. Oh, there I, we go. Oh my God, I'm holding my breath. Why are you holding your breath, bro? <laughs> I'm trying to not move. <laughs> okay, it's taste test time. I think I put a bit too much in my plate. Oh my god, the wine. The wine really gives a taste. And the mushroom. So good. 10 out of 10, you guys. Need to try this so much. Look at all this recycling I have to put out. So I bought a bunch of things to make my Starbucks drink because I literally can't stop ordering it. I also managed to do a lot of filming today. So my friend actually had this milk frother. So I got one for myself. I'm going to try it. I don't like foamy milk, but I feel like it makes the milk thicker. So this is why I'm going to try it. I don't want to heat it up. I want to do it cold. So I'm just going to put the milk in here. Put the lid on. It's basically like a kettle. You put it on here. And we have to hold this for one, two. And it's, oh my God. We love to say it. Oh my God, it's already bubbling away. Then I got some caramel syrup. I put some ice, we're gonna put a bit of milk. The frothy milk. Oh, it's not frothy, I have to do it again. So with this, you really need to use it straight away. I'm gonna put the shot of coffee. It's frothy again now, I'm just gonna put it in. How nice is that? Okay, let's try this. I mean, it's nice. Okay, so I gave the other one to hubby and I put more coffee in mine. I'm just gonna do this. Let me think, that looks kind of good, you know. Let's give it a go, try. I literally have to balance my camera on everything because I've been really trying to vlog, like try my best. Okay, let's give this a go. Oh, see that, the ice. The ice is what makes it iced coffee, you know. So this is really nice, but I would prefer like this much of it. So I need to learn how to make a smaller portion. Anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I'm not going to do anything special tomorrow. I actually have to do more work. So it's just been super busy. And I just like realized there's not one bit of this vlog that's outside. I've just been so busy with work. So, you know, it's your typical at home vlog. I'm going to try and do more stuff during the summer and vlog all of that. 
and yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this vlog um give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and yeah i will see you in my next video bye